Hey YouTube, it's Stuart here from the Passive Income NY Sleep YouTube channel and we're back in the next of the series of the top five niches of the week for merch by Amazon but can also be used for Redbubble, TeePublic, Teespring and whichever other print on demand site you use. So, what are these niches and are there opportunities for you to make some money? Well, sit back, relax, hit that subscribe button and let's get into it. Hey YouTube, just a quick introduction to the channel, particularly for those of you who are new. I'm Stuart, married to my wife Emily with our beautiful baby daughter Mia. And this channel is set up to offer tips and tricks on generating money through passive income, in particular in print on demand. So if this sounds like something you're interested in, then please hit that subscribe button below. And a big thank you to those who already have. If you enjoyed the video, please hit the like button. And for any comments, I'll look to unbat you ASAP. In the meantime, let's get into it. Hey YouTube, so here we are loaded up on the computer. And as I say in all my videos, please, please, please check your copyright before uploading. The niches I'm looking at for you, I don't believe are copyright protected. However, don't just take my word for it. Please check your copyright first and also be mindful of the marketplace that you're uploading to, whether it's .com, .co.uk or Germany or wherever. Be mindful of the copyright for a particular marketplace. So keep that account safe. Now let's get into it and see if we can find some opportunities and most importantly, make some money. Let's get in with straight number one. And this is March Madness. And what I'll do is I will show you some of the designs and also then show you some of the keywords. Take a pause of the screen at the keywords so you can use it to do some sub niche and cross niche and then continue obviously to watch at your own pace. So yeah, look at the designs, look at the keywords. And we're gonna get straight in, like I said, with March Madness. And this is to do with college football. It's a massive tournament in college football which accumulates on the championship game in beginning of April. So these BSRs are fantastic. So be careful with your, careful with your copyright on this one. I don't think it's copyright protected, but be sure, be safe. But let's have a look at some of the designs. We've got 69,130 BSR here. And it's a relatively simple design. So you've just got the sort of game rounds that you will play or match rounds that you will play going up into the quarterfinals, semi-finals, the final, the final. But this is huge. BSRs are massive, obviously going to be very much basketballs within the design and also the basketball kind of colours. So March Madness, 69,000 for the first one. So we like that, that's fantastic. I'm sorry, just jumped down way too fast for you there. Let's try again. Second one, change the default cover. That's a clever thing to do. So... Quite often you'll see everybody's default colour goes to black, but they've changed it to grey and it just helps it stand out a little bit from the competition. When you're scrolling Amazon, you want your designs to stand out and a good way of doing it is by changing your default colour. So grey here with the black text, very simple design, 179,000. Again here, you've got the basketball going into the ring. Again, simple designs, 198,000. A bit further on. January, February, Kentucky, April, March, Basketball Madness, 201,832. Again, we've seen some good default colours here for the thumbnails. So that's really, really good, that is. Uh, similar, simple design here again. You've got the rounds going up to the quarters and the semis. Basketball. And let's have a look a bit further on. Similar designs again, but these BSRs are still fantastic. 286,888. Something a little bit different here. You've got the overlay, it looks like flames behind it. So I know you can do something similar to that if you were using, say, PhotoP, where you can put an overlay of some flames and just clip art it down. So it looks quite a complicated design, but I imagine it was probably done in more of a simple process than what you think. BSR though, 319,000. So some good BSRs making some good money. And again here, got more of a retro sunset look, madness across it, uh, 361,000. So yeah, some good designs, some good BSRs. And let's have a look at our keywords. Obvious things really, got mad, basketball, madness. Um, doo -doo 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 -doo. Nothing massively other than standing out there on these keywords so far. No, no other massive, hmm, that's a strange one, no other massive ones. It says to me maybe we need to be careful with our copyright, perhaps, that's why nothing's coming up. Um, it is to do with college basketball, just be careful with your copyrights. 
well not some huge keywords we can use on this one so that's an interesting one uh, let's bring us up on to number two then which is biden gas and what i will say is one of my designs has actually made niche of the week and it is in this niche i won't show you which one it is but uh, it is within this niche but yeah biden gas this is to do with well i think everybody in the world's feeling it increased fuel prices increased gas prices it's making life difficult for everybody but um this is to do with it around biden and what he's done with them so you got this is a very clever design you got whoever voted biden owns me gas money and you got it from empty to full and you've got the needle on the empty 143,000. similar again with those joe biden colors the blue and the red 161,000. you've got one there with gas price and actually a picture of joe biden um and the arrow going up 206,000. again you've got a similar design here as the one just seen before but the change of default color to gray again stands out then you got make gas prices great again in reference to trump and what he says about making america great again uh 313,425. you got make gas prices great again again you got uh <laughs> you got let's go brandon whoever voted biden owes me gas money uh if you're doing that be careful with let's go brandon if you can create something new because uh, that is a big no-no these days for merch uh, you go again you've got gas prices I did that 400,503 and you got more of a whoever voted Biden owes me gas money and you got a huge jump in prices now that's good that's very detailed that's impressive 454,000 you got any more you got whoever voted Biden owes me gas money you got more of like a like a surfer board kind of look so that's an interesting one as well again default color to gray and what's that 486,041 and last one whoever voted Biden owes me gas money so similar looking design so those are the designs and please comment below see if you can guess which one mine was I'll be interested to see what you think uh, and let's have a look at some of our keywords what we got Biden, Joe, anti is in anti-Biden, President, Trump, uh, Harris was in Kamala Harris, impeach is impeach Biden, Kamala, Democrats, Democrat, different ways of searching for it. Uh, what have we got standing out? Presidential, coal pump is in pumping gas. Um, but other things you'd probably look at would stuff be just gas, fuel, prices money those are some of the other keywords you could probably look at as well are doing um some niching down so you've got prices there so that's number two and that is to do with biden and gas and fuel Bring us up on to number three and this is april fool's day uh, april fool's day fast approaching first of april still gives us a little bit of time to get some designs up uh this one's a bit of fun just messing around 118,671. so you've got some bright colors there it's a nice design that is it stands out and you got down here april 1st you've got the red with the text you got here with the rainbows these rainbow looks seem to be really really popular these days so perhaps that's something to keep in mind we can probably put that in our box like we can unicorns and dinosaurs which always seem to be popped up uh 501,641. so i know not amazing bsrs but it's still money people that's what we need we need the money particularly those rising bills uh april Fool's day we got the jester joker kind of look there and I've seen as well that people mix this with birthdays. So people that are born on the 1st of April, you can get your birthday and your April Fool's mixed together. So perhaps that's an idea for you to look down. Um, what else we've got? April Fool's down nice and bright there. Again with the Jester Joker kind of look there. April 1st. Yeah, we go. April 1st my birthday. No, I'm not lying. So yeah, so you can, people got mixing with birthdays as well. So it's a clever thing to do. And we'll have a look at some of our keywords obvious things april birthday um the ones that are standing out fools so you've got fool fools with an apostrophe different ways of searching for it anniversary yeah so that's a, it's an interesting one it looks like the competition's not too high in it as well so if you can find a different opportunity for cross niche and sub niche the only thing we'll need to do is act quick because it's fast approaching 
So that's number three, April Fool's Day. Brings up onto number four. And this is to do with Easter. Uh, Easter's going to be huge, as obviously always is. Um, but shown it on a different way this way, and that's to do with excavator. So I think it's a really clever one. It's a clever one because it's funny. Digging for eggs, you've got Easter egg hunt. But also you can use it as an opportunity to cross niche at people that work in more the construction industry. Uh, look at that BSR, 24,645. Fantastic BSR, but it's a great design. It's really nice and they deserve all the money that they're making. We'll go a bit further down here. You're going to see a similar principle, 191,000, uh, 847,000. So they're starting to go up now, but bear in mind that Easter's still the 17th, it's the 17th of April for Easter. So it's still a few weeks away. So you'll probably see things like this increase the bsrs get better but also i just wanted to show it this way because it's a different way of looking at easter instead of just putting easter eggs or chocolate or easter bunny taking it down different avenues we'll have a look at some of our keywords easter egg eggs um you probably find you can do an eggs with the apostrophe on the s as well hunting uh chicken <laughs> chocolate uh, toddlers, uh, toddlers love Easter, my mind does. Um, yeah, there's some of my keywords. Like I said, take a pause, have a look, see if we can do some cross niche and sub niche. In. But that's number four, and that's to do with Easter, and that's egg, eggs, gavata. And brings us on to our last one of the week. And this one I've done something slightly different for you, and I've just put and maybe three people, and you'll see what I mean. So people often will put a a hobby or something, and then and maybe three people and it's to do with i like i love so the first one you got here is to do with turtles 329,061 this is never green so this will sell you around which we always like um but you can just change up what people do it for so you can massively scale it obviously you can find something that hasn't been tapped into yet so if someone's done turtle then they've done sharks and all they've done is just change the image and change one word and that's it um, and the sunset in the background is the same as well. It's literally just the shark and the word. And you've got people like, I like chips and salsa, maybe three people. I like cats and maybe three people. Cows, bunnies, horses, coffee, uh, dogs and weed, uh, doodle, tortoises, hippos, and so on and so on and so on. So it's a way that may maybe you can massively scale up a design so if you can come up with something and come up with a hobby or a kind of animal or whatever that people haven't already done do a bit of do a bit of research and you can possibly tap into something unsold before something brand new get your sales on and start making some good money with this for what's relatively a simple niche and like i said you can upscale it so if you can find more than one particular field that hasn't been sold particular animal particular hobby or whatever you can then upscale that massively we'll have a look at some of our keywords people uh you can have stuff like coffee so what you're going to start seeing is people prop up what people will search for so you've got coffee you've got dogs you've got uh cats beer whiskey golf um sister <laughs> and stuff like that so you can use these as an idea to create some of your own uh, niches so you can start making some money and upscale it all you need to do is put a bit of time and research into this one hopefully it will be an, av an avenue for you to make some money so that was our top five niches of the week thank you very much for watching uh hopefully you got some inspiration to make some designs and more importantly make some money thank you very much Bye bye